James Madison University is a public university located in the beautiful Shenandoah Valley of Virginia. There's around 18,000 undergraduates and around 2,000 graduate students here. The Department of Geology and Environmental Science has two programs. One is a Bachelor of Science in Geology, and that's targeted at the person that wants to move on either in research and go on to graduate school or move on into the workforce immediately after graduation as a scientist. We also have a Bachelor of Arts in Earth Science. That degree is targeted towards the individual that would like to communicate science to the non-science audience. Many of our students with a BA in Earth Science will go into uh, Earth Science teaching. There's a profound shortage for Earth Science teachers in Virginia and JMU does really provide a, quite a service to the state. We are working and have gone a long way to becoming the place in Virginia to come to become an Earth Science teacher. At JMU, we have a really strong reputation in the industry for graduating students with the skill sets that they need to work right out of college in geology. Many companies in the area and in the region come and recruit with us because our students are ready with the skill sets needed to work day one after graduation. One of the key attributes of our program is a learning by doing through research. All of our undergraduates conduct research with faculty and we have such a vast array of faculty for them to choose from that literally students can choose almost any subdiscipline in geology and specialize in it at JMU. Some of the areas where we're doing active research in the program include in geospatial technologies. My research here at JMU focuses on um, geological mapping and analysis of mountains and other structural features and it also focuses on education so how do we display these things and teach these concepts to our students. Uh, my research looks at the role of landslides in, in changing the landscape specifically how we lower the mountains over geologic time. It's important not only to understand how the earth has been formed but also how uh, landslides and large floods affect humans uh, in the form of geologic hazards. Our trip to Ireland for, for the field course has several different aspects of being valuable. Uh, number one, uh, they learn te techniques in hydrogeology and geochemistry that they'll use uh, later either in grad school or in the industry. Uh, secondly, they gain confidence by working in a foreign environment that they're probably not used to and that makes them a better well-rounded professional geologist in the future. An important area of research where faculty are focusing is in aqueous geochemistry. We study the origin and fate of water uh, in the hydrosphere uh, using either chemical tools or uh, in most cases, I work with uh, groundwater flow models. Research is generally uh, useful for uh, preparing students to work uh, in uh, both the state and federal and private industry, uh, as well as uh, this is a good opportunity for them to get experience in the field and the lab for uh, doing water chemistry analysis and field work involving uh, water chemistry. Another area where we're doing an awful lot of research is in the area of studying the Shenandoah Valley and the volcanic rocks in the Shenandoah Valley. I study Eocene age volcanoes 48 to 50 million years old in Virginia and the reason why we're really interested in them is because they are sampling the mantle and lower crust underneath the east coast of the United States that nobody has any idea for sure what it really looks like. We have faculty at JMU that are focusing their research in paleo-oceanography and paleoclimatology. The main research field is paleo-oceanography and paleoclimatology. So looking at ocean seafloor records, so cores from the seafloor, that we can recover and um, reconstruct how ocean and climate conditions have changed in the past studying past climate change through seafloor sediment records and other archives gives us the context to understand and make predictions about the future. JMU as a university is a great place to be. It's full of really friendly people. Um, everybody's really open and happy to be here. Um, we have great professors. We have a great student life. It's just, it's a really fun
fun place to be and it's a really great place to get your education. I'm very optimistic about the future of the programs here. In the last few years, we've been able to expand the faculty, expand the number of students that we have, and most importantly, we've expanded the facilities and the equipment in the facilities. We have new laboratories with new equipment like a new IRMS, a new ground penetrating radar units. We've got AA units, Dianics units. We've infused all of our mapping with technology. Quite simply, I am very optimistic about where our students are going.